Greetings respected viewers welcome to Grip Trade family Sami here together we win and together we'll make each other win for sure today i'm going to suggest you a very reputable strategy that is going to help you at different points of time once you start using it the strategy is really joyful interesting and easy once you understand it the steps i'll follow is that i'll uh, implement the strategy initially and then i'll illustrate it to you people moreover luckily if i dig any signal i'll surely put a trade on that so this is how i can assist you to have a way forward in pocket options or any other broker that you are using to have consistency in the binary strategy winning binary trading winning all that stuff i need to tell you a bit of background that i keep on back testing couple of months of data and then i summarize certain points of time where you can trade really profitably so you need to understand that there are certain parts of the day when you can use different strategies for trading consistently in profits so you have to take care of this thing that you cannot keep on using one strategy all the times and keep on expecting win uh winning consistently by doing so if you try to use one strategy all the times that might deviate you from making profits so you have to be vigilant in this regard you have to use different strategies for different points of time different combinations of, of indicators are needed to be used one more thing that you need to remember is that um, this keeps on getting modified so i always hand over you the updated information regarding the modifications in the time slots modification in the combination of indicators if you reach me out on my contact details mentioned in the video so you are always welcome to reach me out for having any sort of assistance that includes having the updated time slots along with the updated combination of indicators so let's switch towards the implementation of the strategy without wasting any time and the strategy is really easy you need to set the chart type as candles for this once you set the chart type as candles you need to set the candle time period which can be 1 minute or 2 minutes okay so you can set it at any time period the candle time period okay the candle time period 2 minute means or 1 minute means that each candle is showing you a fluctuation of 1 minute or 2 minute okay so each candle is showing you a fluctuation of accumulatively 1 minute or 2 minute whatever you set now you need to set the indicators the indicators you need to set are very simple they include one moving average one alpha oscillator and one rsi so there you go now i'll set the moving average for you initially and one more thing uh, i already told you that irrespective of any broker that you are using you can opt for this strategy and expect continuous winning conditional to the fact that you have to follow the certain points of time when to use which strategy i have already uploaded many of the profitable strategies but you have to use those strategies at different points of time so for having consistency in getting rewarded so let me edit the indicators now which is pretty simple easy you need to set the first indicator the moving average period the moving average period be set as 101 okay now you need to set the moving average type which can be exponential moving average in this case okay so there are like four types of moving averages we have to select ema exponential moving average well feel free to reach me out in case if you will be having any queries confusion i'm always available you need to set the styles of your choice so that you can easily watch and remember what you apply So I there I save it. Now I have set the moving average. Now I'm going to set the awesome oscillator. The awesome oscillator needs to be set as following: two period short two and the period long one ninety six. Styles of your choice, and you can save it. Now you need to set the RSI as well. The period fourteen is fine for me. Overbought seventy five, oversold twenty five. 
colors and pixels of your choice and once i do that of my choice then i'll click save okay let me set the colors and pixels of my choice mm. there i make it two pixels as well and there i save it so there i go all that we needed to set has been already set now and now what we need to do is that we need to we need to set the signal we need to find the signal in fact not set the signal we will we'll have to find the signal so let me show you some latest examples to illustrate to you before that let me tell you that these there are two regions in awesome oscillator the positive region and the negative region okay so you see the bars above the zero baseline it's the positive region of awesome oscillator bars below the zero baseline it's the negative region of the awesome oscillator so the other things will work around this okay now whenever you see that awesome oscillator bars the red bars of awesome oscillator are switching themselves from positive region to the negative region just like at this point you see they are finishing completing in the positive region declining to zero and then they are starting to appear in the negative region so once you see this happening you can simply simply find out where is the moving average so note this down so that you do not miss how to go towards digging a signal which is pretty simple interesting and easy once you understand this okay so you see the moving average is above the candles at that point when the awesome oscillator red bars are switching from the positive region to the negative region so when this happens that the moving average is also above the candles you need to see if the rsi is very near to the lower or the upper limit it's near to the lower limit at the in this case okay so once you see this you can simply opt for a sell trade the two confirmations that you always need to have are that the awesome oscillator switches from the positive region to the negative region and the moving average line is uh, above the candles so this is how you can opt for a sell trade a lower trade a put option and how to dig a buy signal now okay let me find out if i can dig a recent live example so that i can show it to you and you can understand how does this goes in our favor um yeah there you see and one more thing that you need to remember i'm sorry oops okay so there isn't there is a glitch <laughs> no worries so no worries let me let me find out the bias signal the buy trend for you so you see here okay the awesome oscillator bars the green bars finishing in the lower region okay and once they finish in the lower region always remember that the purchase time purchase time should be two minutes for this particular strategy okay it should be two minutes not one minute so you see whenever this uh, awesome oscillator green bars finish in the negative region start appearing in the positive region you need to see where the moving average is if the moving average is below the candles at this point of time as it is there so there are two confirmations that we got so once you see this you can simply opt for a uh, buy trade if the rsi is also very near to the upper or the lower limit so in this case the rsi is very near to the upper limit so uh you see since the candles are showing you the fluctuation of one minute or two minute whichever you set here it is two minutes so your your purchase will immediately execute in profit once you opt for the buy trade okay so there you understand the way i have told you to opt for 
okay you can use this strategy on candle time period one minute as well so this is how you can keep on winning keep on making something out of trade and i hope that you got the points that i needed to convey you um you see we discussed this signal which has just recently occurred so that's how you can keep on winning that's the best possible way i i could have told you with latest real time examples that have currently occurred so i guess you got the point that i needed to convey you that's all for now your trade is a family stay connected stay in touch stay happy take a lot of care see you very soon and feel free to get in touch in case if you have any sort of queries or you require coaching collaboration getting your systems managed or anything that's all for now bye bye see you respectable viewers i hope you liked the video for more informational stuff stay tuned to the channel i've been into trading since years and i aim to impart all that knowledge in you people other than that for any collaborative ideas or any sort of queries that you want to get resolved you can contact me on my personal details mentioned in the video description